Hello. Here we are with Amiana Lepore, the most famous transsexual with the world with a new polemic album, War of the Words. Tell me a little about it. Hello, this. we are here with our War of the Words. I am so excited about my new album. Uh, I really love all my fans because they are love my album. They are on my Facebook page telling me you are gorgeous, you are beautiful and I'm very happy with all of that. Really thank you all for accepting my new album. I like it very much and I I was thinking in my bedroom one night on um, Utopia made so success and I thought how about a premium edition the looks here and I thought I will make War of the Words um, an expansion of Utopia new music premium you know to make um, the continuation of the success to make everyone dance like crazy and happy loving each other with my music it's very important to me you know I love and it and what about the music? Uh, the music talk about futuristic things uh, madness um, uh, every, everything you know about the space the utopia you know like I was making a uh, uh, song. And what do they aboard? Uh, what's your favorite one? Uh, my new favorite one, it's hard to say because I love all of them, but I like very much the like, speech on um, Lila Billy, Mega Tsunami. Uh, Mega Tsunami is very hard to believe that is incredible music because the lyrics are too short. Um, but I. But I really love the music video about the people drowning themselves because they were bad. Is that I I think about that when I was making the music video from that movie Mega Tsunami, and it's very realistic. You know, I appear only the end of the music video, but I like it very much too. I like every music, you know, and the choreography. Uh, the choreography is I really don't talk about, uh, I don't think about it and because uh, what is really important to me is the music, the music video and the scenes, the choreographies are not really important to me, you know. I really like enjoying the lyrics, the beat of the music. Um, and what about the, the lyrics? The lyrics are very, very uh, important. You know, they make the people have goosebumps. Uh, and do you think your music make people happy? You think they oh, could yeah, change yeah. people's lives? Yeah, I really just think that. Just because they are so deep. Yeah, they are deep and they are really, really? Uh, incredible. Really? Yeah, yeah. I think that because uh, when you listen to the music, you will fall in love with it if you like it, of course, and you really start enjoying it this time that that you're listening to the music. And is that what really matters? Um, you know, I really like my own music, but I like Madonna, I like Lady Gaga, and Beyonce, and Britney too. But I really think my music is important because they are transmitting messages. And do you inspire yourself by them in your music videos, your songs? What do you think? Do, does this this artist yeah, have yeah, in a life. bitch. I like them a bitch, but I my biggest inspiration is Marilyn Monroe, like you can see in my music video Marilyn and on t artificial mind too. It's a bitch like Marilyn. They are like they are very very like each other. But now we are in the war of the words and I'm talking about Utopia. You were asking you are mad. We are here to talk about War of the Words. But you know War of the Words is a delusion. Yeah but what why uh, are the let me say let me say something because they look suggestions because I the people are really sad with the end of Utopia and I was sad with that too because that age of utopia for me it was very very important to me and i don't want that to end i have to create i i thought in my 
bedroom that night. I have to create something, something more, and I think about the War of the Worlds and there it is. The War of the Worlds are uh, extension of Utopia, a deluxe edition. Now you can buy Utopia songs with more new one to tell you. And what do you think about future generations? What would they say about your new album? You think they would see like they see Madonna? Uh, I don't know because Madonna is a bit older than me and I... Well, I am like that. I am obsessed with future. I know we are we are already in the future. Yeah, the, you're right. You can see the technology uh, and everything surrounding us, around us. Uh, that's incredible because every day is a new thing coming of Japan and the worldwide too. You can see every day is a new thing, technology. Um, I am surrounded by future. We are surrounded, and I have to say that. In some days, we will see spaceships instead of cars and mm, everything changing around us. We will be surprised, of course, but we are expected to of seeing that things, you know. Um, it's difficult to accept it, but I like the future. I yeah. like her. Have you ever watched Fifth Element? Yeah, yeah, I love that movie. Uh, you know, I was thinking about making a music video that I w would be Lilu, but I, um, I don't know. Uh, I am friend of Mila Jovovich, and I, but I didn't, I don't speak to her very much, and I don't know if if she will be uh, very happy to see me doing a cosplay of Lilo. And what do you have to say about more your album? Oh, uh, my album is very good. Uh, they are will be out after all the singles will be revealed. I'm posting. And what about the music's releasing? I'm posting on my Facebook page. Religion? My. The list of the songs, they will come mm. and everyone and will see. Why are you posting on Facebook? Do you think this is good to show fans to be close to them? Of, of course, of course, because because you know some people are lost of watch on watching music videos on listen to my new songs. I have to organize things and show them when they are going to be uh, um release it and I um I'm think about that. Organization is always good. It's always beautiful to post things there. Uh, listen to my new song. Listen to my new music. See my new music video, and that's very good because you can interact with them. My fans, they send me messages, and I'm very good. And are you planning to 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 launch a new music um, video? Yeah, I'm thinking about Lila Billy. I never. I never said that before to on Facebook or on another website, but I'm thinking about Lila Billy. Really, I think the music is very, very gorgeous and impactant, and I will. Uh, I'm thinking about l launching a music video about that because Lila Billy is an incredible robotic woman who came yeah, from space. Yeah, I heard about it. It's too. Um, tough. and uh, I have to say something too because. I I don't I didn't want to reveal that, but I have to because you're talking to me uh, and you are influencing me. Uh. Wow, Lila Billy is a robotic woman that came from the space and she wants to destroy the Earth. And why she's doing this? Because she's utopic, or there's any other special reason? Because sometimes yeah, yeah. you leave adventures in your videos, you know. And I can't fully understand them. Uh -huh. Tell me about it's it. It's very difficult to understand something about my my vi some videos of mine. Difficult to understand. But Lila Billy represents the technology nowadays because uh, technology is destroying the world that God created. You know, and Lila Billy came from the space. She wants to destroy buildings and eat the people. You know, consume it their souls and things like that, you know, and I I thought about a woman, a robotic giant woman. Yeah, 
really. And what inspired you to do this theatrical and oh. movies? Can you repeat the question, please? I'm a bit lost. I don't know what <laughs> you mean with that. <laughs> okay. And um, what but let me talk something first, of course. Uh, well, I don't think so. I don't. I don't want that much because I, I'm loving this album. You know, it's very difficult to explain that. I'm sorry. But what inspires you to do these music videos? Uh, they are quite tri theatrical, you know. They look like Lady Gaga. Um, I, I, I am a bit tired of Gaga. You know, I always appreciated her music videos. Not much for on um, the fame on her board. This way, I like her. I, I like the fame more, but I um, like Marilyn, uh, Marilyn Monroe and um, Lana Del Rey is good too. And I'm planning something about um, the back age for my next albums because I uh, I am a bit tired of those futuristic things. You know, I love future, but um, we get tired of them. Are you planning to do a 60? A 60? Yeah, yeah, I'm thinking album. about that too. Um, because talking about the future is very interesting, but how about the past? Oh, I know it. The past combines it fits Yeah, the, the past is very good too. So, are you planning this album already? And did you already end this new album? No, no, I don't even start it yet. Because, um... Uh, War of the Worlds is consuming me and I have to end War of the Worlds first Then I will take a breath and I will start to think about the next album So we have to take yeah. you very Yeah, much. I, I, I thank, thank you, you. I thank you You are wonderful, your album is very good and I'm gonna listen to it Of course, everyone there please buy my album